So good morning everybody. It is May 2nd, Monday morning, and I've been stuck now for a total of an hour and I think nine minutes waiting for this uh, accident here to clear. And I can't stress it any more than just say accidents I believe are 99% avoidable if people would just pay attention, not rush around, stop speeding, stop diving between cars, slow down, because all this does is cause a headache for everybody. So I don't know what happened here, if a, I'm not sure yet if a truck or something came on from the turnpike here too fast and rolled over, I don't know yet, so just waiting to see when I get up here see cars like this drive on the shoulder it's like we all got to get places people you know so now I'm behind on my day I got up early this morning at 345 hopes to get up to Jacksonville so what I'm doing is going to the Jacksonville port and uh, gonna be picking up a load and taking it up to uh, North Carolina so I don't see a vehicle but looks like probably yep a track trailer carrying rocks or pavers here he lost his load. Slow down, truck drivers. It causes big mess for everybody. So sick of it. Anyways, not gonna rant anymore. Just wanna show you guys uh, what I was sitting in there. So I'll catch back up when I get to the port and uh, we'll do some filming there if I can. It's pretty secure there. So I might not be able to film now I think about it, but. We'll see, at least I'll film getting into the port to the point where I got to check in. And then I have to follow an escort car to get down to get loaded, it's a live load. So, in any case, I'll catch back up a little bit. Hope everybody had a good weekend and uh, I will talk to you soon. So we're at Blount Island Marine Terminal. That's where we're picking up here. Keep right on to Blood Island Road toward Marine Terminal.
trucks left lane only, huh? Okay. Well, I gotta be in the right lane up here, so I don't know what that's all about. They must change this a little bit. You've got to go up here to the right because I don't have a Tux card. So up here I got to get in the right lane. So now it says Tux to the right. could be a long line here. We'll see. Hey folks, I'll film in a little bit when I get a little closer. Well, good morning from Shelby, North Carolina. So just take us some of these back roads to get to uh, a place we're delivering to, which is a paper plant. And supposedly it's a drop, dropping hooks, so let's hope. But when I looked online, I don't see anybody talking about dropping hooks. So, And the window they gave is between 8 and 3, so I don't know if this is going to be a live unload or if this is going to be a dropping hooks. We're going to find out. So we're only about 11 miles from the place. Never been to this one before, so this is new. But this is uh, State Route 18 through North Carolina here. Just kind of, a lot of these paper places are back in the, the woods and everything because they, uh, this really isn't a place I think about. It's not a place that makes paper, but it seems like paper plants or paper places are just in the woods it seems like are off the beaten path I've seen to notice but uh it's not too far away I didn't do a lot of filming yesterday I I, I had to shut the camera down at the uh the Jacksonville port because they're very strict about I mean they search your truck to make sure you don't got firearms they check to make sure you don't have passengers because you can't you can't take any passengers with you all kinds of things so I really couldn't do any filming, so long and short of it, I uh, I couldn't do anything there. So, and then uh, pretty much when I left yesterday, I was just driving. There wasn't much to see, so I uh, shut down last night at a Loves up in uh, South Carolina, and then um, got up this morning. It's now about 8:34. Says we'll be there about 8:45. So, might be able to do a little bit of filming here at this place. It's not, it's not a secure place or facility. So, but uh, so I saw a film a little bit, just gone through the, the countryside here in North Carolina. So, hope everybody's having a good day. And uh, if you're new to the channel please click that subscribe button and then click on the bell that alerts you of future videos. Let's see what this says here. Littering, I thought it was a truck sign. <laughs> First thought it was a truck sign saying no trucks. I'm like, no, that can't be. But anyways, yeah, if it's your first time here and you want to subscribe, I do appreciate that. And uh, just click that subscribe button, click the bell, alert your future videos. And if there's any comments you have, good, bad, ugly, whatever, I take uh, criticism very well, so the only way I can make these videos better is to uh, 
is to hear your feedback. So I don't know if this camera's set right because I couldn't get it linked up with my phone. So I hope it is. But uh, here comes a logging truck now. Actually, no, he's not a logging truck. I thought he was. But in any case, folks, what I'll do is uh, maybe I'll film a little bit more. And then uh, I will definitely film some backing um, at the uh, facility when I come to it. I did a Google view of the place, so it looks like it's pretty simple. Sometimes I don't like these, these back roads. They can be... Uh, pretty treacherous sometimes they can be uh, real tight and everything but and this is a you guys can't see this but this is a pretty sharp well when I turn right here you just can't see the left that well so I probably could go but I just can't see if any cars are coming over around the bend miles an hour. Man, they got to change those signs. Those signs keep looking like they say no littering, but they almost look like no trucks allowed type of signs. Alright folks, I'll catch back up here when we get to this facility and then we'll do some filming there. So I'll talk to you soon, folks. Go for some Taco Bell right now. Or Sonics. I'm really heavy. I got 45,000 pounds of trying to get up this little hill here is a little tough. Boy, it's crazy how weather is because I was listening to weather this morning and it's sunny now. It's beautiful outside. 70 degrees, beautiful, no humidity. 
but they're calling for showers. I'm just actually surprised. It's actually a cool little town. I wouldn't mind living here. Everything looks closed though, it's kind of weird. It's 8.42 in the morning and there's like nobody at these places. No traffic. I always like towns like this. Looks like an old CVS that closed down. It's now only about five miles away. I just thought I'd film a little bit more. I was gonna just start filming at when I get there, but I like these little towns. Tough to get giddy up and go. Yeah, when I weighed myself uh, on the scale before I got fuel, I was like 31,200, no, 33,260 on my tandems, 32,000, I think 160 or 90 on my drives, and I filled with fuel this morning, so I'm probably equal now. Probably about 33,000. 300 maybe on both both axles now. spot there. Must be his house. Jeez. Uh, just struggling to get up these hills. trucks in front of me, they're probably gone in the same place. I told this place has a long line, it seems like, to check in, but we'll see. on the right. Turn at the first ride on to customer first street. Yeah, 
I've definitely never been here before. folks well check in the gate and then uh, probably put the uh, mirror cam on fill them back in and uh, we'll go from there 